Hey guys, welcome back to my channel, or welcome to your first time in my corner of the internet. My name is Timpani, for those of you who don't know me, and if you don't know me, then you picked a fabulous video to watch, because today I'm going to be doing a get to know me while I get ready video. So essentially, I'm going to be doing my makeup and answering a few questions. I just found some questions from like randomly on the internet. Um, so yeah, I'm just gonna scroll through my little list, answer my questions as I do my makeup. Pretty self-explanatory. All right, guys, so let's go ahead and get started. I'm um, first gonna just like prime my face. This is just the Milk Hydro Grip Primer. Uh, so the first question and the second question were, uh, where'd you grow up and where do you currently live? So I grew up in Peoria, Arizona, and I currently live in Surprise, Arizona. Next, I'm going to prime my eyelids with a little bit of concealer. Um, the next question is, how tall are you? I am 5'8 and a half. Um, dogs or cats? Dogs. What year were you born? I was born in 1993. In July, my birthday is July 5th. So I'm a Cancer, for those of you wondering. For today's eyeshadow look, I'm going to be using the Morphe 18S Sunset Beats palettes. I'm just gonna go in with this orange shade here on a big fluffy brush and pop that into my crease area. Um, the next question is, are you or have you gone to college? I have gone to college. I went to Northern Arizona University in Flagstaff, Arizona. Um, I graduated with a bachelor's in strategic communications, emphasis in public relations, and a minor in journalism. I also studied abroad twice, um, both times in London. Uh, the first time I went to London Metropolitan University, um, and the second time I went to Regents University. And yeah, I thoroughly enjoyed both of my time sitting abroad there. I I don't want to be cliche and say it was life-changing, but it was pretty life-changing, you know? So it opened my eyes um, to a lot of different things, and it really kind of like awakened my like passion for traveling. Next question is, what is your favorite drink? Um, Non-alcoholic drink, I'm going to say uh, coffee. I'm a big coffee drinker. I love coffee. I don't drink it for caffeine. I drink it because I actually enjoy the taste of it. So, yeah. And then alcoholic, um, favorite go-to drink if I like not ordering something like some fruity specialty cocktail of that establishment um, is a gin and tonic. You're wearing perfume. What scent is it? Um, I have a few different perfumes that I like, but Mainly right now, I've been really liking the Gucci Bloom. Next question is tea or coffee? Easy, coffee. Just said I was a big coffee drinker. Love me some coffee. All right, next I'm going to go in with this dark brown shade here and I'm just taking that on a Morphe 433. Just put that in my, I'm gonna go with palette. I'm um, just gonna pop that in the corner of my eye. Um, next question is what sports do you play or have you played? So in high school, I ran track, I played basketball, and I was on, or wasn't on, sorry, um, and I also did dance. Next question is, um, what is your favorite movie? So I don't really have a favorite, like I'm very indecisive, so it's hard for me to pick favorites. <laughs> um, but I'm gonna give you like top three, I guess, so. One being Zack and Miri make a porno. Me and my best friend Sam used to watch that movie all the time in high school growing up. Like, we watched it so many times that we can just pretty much quote the entire thing. So, that's one. Um, also, a huge fan of Moana. Do I have a third? Oh, The Holiday. The Holiday with um, Cameron Diaz and Kate Winslet. Right? Is Kate Winslet? I think so. Anyway, yeah. So those are like my top three favorite movies. Next, I'm going to take this pretty coppery shade down here on my finger and just apply that to my lid. Next question is, do you speak any languages and how well? I do not speak any other languages. Um, I, I mean, okay, let me, let's try that again. <laughs> I took French 
in college and I took Spanish in high school um, for a year each. I remember a little bit of both, um, but it's not anything that I could really use, you know? I can say some key phrases <laughs> and that is about it. Also, I've messed up my eyeshadow, but that's neither here nor there. Um, I'm going to try to fix this with a little bit more of this orange shade over here and just kind of blending that above this orange glitter. It looked more coppery here, but it's very orange. Um, so the next question is, are you single or are you taken? I am very single. I'm what me and my friends like to call super single. That's like, you know, there's no hopes, no prospects, nothing just like in the vicinity. That's, you know, the level of single that I currently am. How many siblings do you have? I have six siblings, technically. Not technically, I have six siblings. <laughs> um, my parents were both married before they married each other. And so my dad had three kids from his previous marriage and my mom had three kids from her previous marriage. And so I'm the only kid from their marriage actually. Um, but I have four sisters and two brothers. So next I'm going to go in with some liner. This is just the NYX Epic Ink Liner in black. And my next question is, do you use PC or Mac? I use Mac. I just actually got a new MacBook um, a couple weeks ago. So yeah, I'm a Mac user. Mainly because also like I have an iPhone, an Apple Watch, all Apple products. So I just feel like you should kind of like stick to one or the other because So that they communicate better when you have all of one than whatever else. I'm gonna do my eyeliner not on camera because I can't do that. I'm gonna put some mascara on and then answer my next question, which is how many countries have you traveled to? I have traveled to, I think it's 17. I think 17 countries. Next question is, do you have any pets? Yes, I have a dog. I technically have two dogs. Um, one's named Tiger and one is named Bella. Next, I'm going to do my foundation. I'm going in with the NARS Natural Radiant Longwear Foundation, um, which is quickly becoming one of my favorite foundations. Um, while I do that, the next question is, what are your pet peeves? Um, one of my biggest pet peeves is people that don't know how to communicate. That's like my biggest pet peeve is lack of communication. Next question is what is your favorite color? Um, again, I'm a very indecisive person, so I don't really have a favorite color. Um, I'm more attracted to like muted shades of colors. So I don't like like lime green, but I like sage and I don't like cobalt blue, but I like navy. So, but if I had to pick one color, to call my favorite, I guess it would be black, even though it's technically lack of color, but neither here nor there. <laughs> I next I'm just gonna blend out my concealer using a beauty sponge. Let's find our next question while I do that. Do you know your personality type? What is it? Um, so in the like color test, um, depending, I guess, on my mood is what my color test will be, but I'm either usually, um, orange primary, blue secondary, or blue secondary, orange. What? No. <laughs> um, depending, I mean, <clears throat> I'm either usually orange primary, blue secondary, or blue primary, orange secondary, is typically what those come out to. Um, Myers-Briggs is E-N-F-P, right? E-N-F-P? Yeah. I think I'm an ENFP for that one. Um, I don't really understand the like numbers one. I feel like I can never get an accurate read on that one. So not sure about that one, but yeah. Next, I'm going to set my under eye using some Kunafa powder from Huda Beauty. Next question is, have you been to any festivals or concerts? I've been to plenty. Um, I've been to Coachella. I've been to Life is Beautiful in Vegas. I went to the Intersect Festival in Vegas um, this past December. Um, I think that's all the music festivals I've been. Oh, wait, no, I went to the Radio One Big Weekend when I studied abroad in England. 
um, which was really, really cool. Um, I got to see Katy Perry and the Kings of Leon and a bunch of other people. But for Katy Perry, um, we were like front row for Katy Perry at this festival, which was pretty awesome. Um, and then for concerts, I've been to plenty of those as well. Um, some of my favorite people to see in concert are uh, 21 Pilots. They put on an amazing show for only being like two guys on stage. Um, they are really fun to watch live. Oh, and I forgot, I went to, um, I'm not sure if it's Oceaga, Oceaga, I'm not sure how you say it, but it's a festival that happens in Montreal during the summer and that was also really great. That was like one of the best festivals I've been to as far as the lineup goes. Like 21 Pilots was there, George, um, yeah, George Ezra, um, Young the Giant of Monsters and Men, Florence the Machine, Kendrick Lamar, Weezer, um, and there were like so many more. I don't know. It was an excellent lineup that year that I went. I went in 2015, I think. Fabulous lineup. Fabulous lineup. Okay, so now I'm gonna go ahead and do my brows. I'm going under some dip brow from Anastasia. This is in the shade Dark Brown. And for our next question, we have, what is your middle name? My middle name is Porsche. I really don't have a clue where my mom came up with that name, um, but it's Porsche. <laughs> Fun fact, my name is Timpani, um, cause my dad wanted me to have a musical name. So he named me after a drum. Um, but my mom was going to combine my sister's name and my brother's name and call me Darinisha. So there's that. Next is what is your favorite song at the moment? Um, and that, um, right now I'm really loving, um, You Should Be Sad by Halsey. I just really like that song. Um, I also really like Adore by Amy Shark. I heard it on a show um, called Stumptown. That's actually really good. It has um, Colby Smulders, the girl from um, How I Met Your Mother, and the um, like the right hand to the guy to Samuel L. Jackson in the Marvel movies. Her. Um, it has her in it, and it's actually a really good show. So if you're looking for a show to watch, um, Stumptown on Hulu. I just got a package multiple packages. Next I'm going to go in with some blush. I'm going to be using my Fenty Cream blush in Strawberry Drip. And then for our next question we have what would you or have you named your children? I don't have any children but I do know that I would like to have a daughter named Tyler. That's like the only name that I really have picked out. Is Tyler for a girl. Next, I'm gonna to go to my bronzer, which is the Cover FX bronzer in Suntan Bronze. Realized I should put this on before my blush, but neither here nor there. Uh, next question. What is your favorite animal? I don't really have one. And this one is not because I'm not, in this. actually, elephants. Elephants are my favorite animal. I'm gonna say I don't have one, but. Elephants are actually my favorite animal. All right guys, so I just realized that I, I'm all sorts of discombobulated trying to like do my makeup and answer these questions. I'm jumping all over the board. Like I did my eyeliner before I do my base, which I never do. And then I just did my blush and my bronzer without putting on powder first. So here we are, I guess. Um, we're just gonna skip powder day and then jump right on to lips. I'm not sure what I wanna do for lips. Um, it's my big old thing of lipsticks. Let's just do something new today. That's not nude, that's that's bright red. Um, we'll do this, here we go. This is a lip gloss from Just Colors in Just Because. And then we'll go ahead and do one more question. What is your favorite restaurant? Um, that's, uh, all these favorite questions, I don't have favorites, remember? <laughs> um, I really like, you know, I'm just gonna go with BJ's. I'm gonna go with BJ's because I used to work there. I worked at BJ's for almost two years, um, which was cool. I was a hostess and then I did take out and then I was a server for a little while before I moved into the job that I no longer have. So 
So maybe I should suck with BJ's because I could have been on track to be your manager probably by now. Alright guys, so that is it for today's video. I hope you enjoyed this get to know me while I get ready type video. If you did, please give it a big thumbs up. Also, leave me a comment down below letting me know if there's anything else that you would like to know about me. I can film a more specific uh, Q&A in the future. So just leave me a question down below. And yeah, that is all for today's video. Make sure to subscribe for more future content. I hope to see you guys in another video. Bye.